Hello friends, welcome to Spartan GRE. In this video, we'll discuss how to solve recursion problems in a single step. But before doing that, I'll tell you the normal procedure as well, the traditional way to solve them. And then I'll tell you the best shortcut for that recursion problem. That is not actually shortcut, it is actually derived from the traditional method itself. So first, uh, better to learn traditional way, then we'll move on to our shortcut. Now, this first question is posted in Spartan CRE WhatsApp group. Some of our aspirants has posted this question. So before solving this question, I'll take a few examples and we'll learn the concept on using those examples. So let's get started. Our first question is 6.8 bar. So 6.8 bar means the number will be 6.888 and so on. So 8 is a recurring infinity times. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll take this 6.8 bar as X. That means it will be 6.8888 and so on. Right. So this will be my value of X. If I take 10 X, that means if I multiply 10 on both sides, this number will be 68.888 and so on. Right. Now, if I subtract this X from 10 X, what will happen is and so on. So you will get here 9x and then this will be 62. That implies x will be 62 by 9. So this is your answer. Now we will solve second question also in the same manner. Here x is 48.623 bar. That means number will be 48.62333 and so on. So if I do 100x, right, if I do 100x, this value will become 4862.3333 and so on. If I subtract x from 100x, okay, then what happens is here I will get 48.62. So it will be 48.62, but then we don't want any number after decimal. Then we'll get an integer form, right? But uh, if you subtract 10x, uh, x, it will not be possible here. So what I'll do is I'll multiply with 1000 x, 1000. So it will be, if I multiply with 1000, it will be 48623.333 and so on. Now, if you subtract 100 x from this 1000 x, see this. Now, you will get integral part after decimal. That means you won't get a, you will get a zero value in, uh, after decimal. See, 100 X will be 4862.333 and so on. Now, if you subtract these two things, this whole uh, numbers after decimal will get canceled and you will get an integer value. So this will be 900 X equal to one and this will be six nine seven five three four now x will be four three seven six one by nine hundred so this will be our answer now i'll show you how to do this problem using shortcut in a single line see this how you'll solve this is forty eight six two three minus four eight six two so this will be one six seven three four now i'll write four three seven six one by nine and double zero that's it this will be my final answer so i'll explain how i am able to write in a single step so now let's solve this question in the direct way how to solve is first of all write the number as it is the number is 6.8 so write it as uh, 68 right L normally 68 take the decimal and write the number right 68 minus what you have to do is you have to subtract all the numbers which are not recurring so here 6 is not recurring so remove that 6 by you have to put number of nines will be equal to number of digits recurring Suppose here we have one digit recurring, right? So you'll put one nine and 
you'll put number of zeros equal to number of digits not recurring after decimal so there is there is 6.8 bar that means there is no number which is not recurring after a point so leave it as it is so this will be 62 by 9 done i repeat what you have to do is if you have 6.8 bar you take this number without any decimal so 68 minus what you have to do is you subtract numbers whichever is not recurring in the given number what are the numbers not recurring this is uh, this whenever you have bar that is recurring the number without bar will be non recurring so remove that 6 by in denominator you have to consider numbers only after decimal check uh, the numbers after decimal which are recurring and non recurring you have to put nines equal to recurring how many digits are recurring that many nines you have to put in denominator and you have to put zeros to non recurring numbers so here after decimal you have only one digit and that digit is recurring so put one nine that's it so it will be 62 by 9 your final answer now we'll solve this question first write the number as it is removing the decimal 48623 from this number you have to subtract all the numbers that are not recurring from the given number so all this part is not recurring right so that will be 4862 this whole part is not recurring by now you will consider when you are writing denominator you have to consider only numbers after decimal so after decimal you have three numbers and in these three only one number is recurring and two numbers are non-recurring so for this recurring number you put one nine here and for this non-recurring numbers you put two zeros because there are two zeros if you do this calculation it will be four three seven six one by nine hundred you got this in a single step right now let's solve this question using direct method because by now you are aware of the method right now write this number as it is 5238 minus remove non-recurring numbers 52 is a non-recurring number by now consider only numbers after decimal we have two numbers and both are recurring that means you have to put double nine so this will be six and five eight one one five five one eight six by ninety nine so this will be your answer now let us solve the question asked in whatsapp group this is a question 7.583 bar first write the number as it is so i will write it as 7583 from this number i will subtract the number which are not recurring all this part is not recurring so write it 758 by so in numerator you should not consider decimal okay but in denominator you have to consider numbers after decimal so what are the numbers after decimal the numbers after decimal are these three numbers right out of these three numbers only one number is recurring so put one nine and two numbers are not recurring so put two zeros that's it your answer is 7583 minus 758 when you solve it you will get 5 and 2 and 8 and 1 6 so 6 8 2 5 by 900 you can simplify it further right with 5 it goes get cancelled so anyway this will be your answer and uh, <coughs> you can either put this as your answer or even you can simplify it further and you can put the same no issues i hope you enjoyed this video Please do subscribe to the channel and I hope you share this video among your friend circles. Thank you.